get there. Don't worry. I want to stay in this game for a hot second, guys, uh, and go to the sideline. Former Alabama teammates caught on camera for the wrong reason. We had a little scuffle there between Jonathan Allen and Deron Payne. Listen, I get it. They were frustrated. Dallas was owning them. Both players downplayed it after the game. But is this a big deal, RC? No, it's not. It's not necessarily a, a big deal, right? I don't look at this to say that these two, these two guys should be admonished for what they did. But you got to be better than this, right? When when you're getting your butts whipped or your butts handed to you the way that the Washington football team is, don't be fighting each other. Go fight on the field, right? right? Yeah. If you you, you want to mush somebody, sure. right? You want to put your finger in somebody's <laughs> face? Go put your face mask on somebody. And to me, that's the issue. Like dudes argue and then dudes fight and yeah. dudes have. Like, like these kind of confrontations, right? Like uh, Rex was laughing about the fact that his pops uh, punched the OC when he was coaching for the Houston Oilers. So these things happen. Right. But my problem is they can't happen when the game looks the way it looks, when you refuse to go out and fight. And then when you're a guy like Payne who sits on the sideline side and pouts the rest of the first mm. half because you're so focused on the fact that you got stole on for something you did yeah, yeah, yeah. to a yeah. captain, yeah. to a pro bowler. And yeah. so to me, it's more so about can we focus on what's going on on the field rather than focusing on each other and what we're saying. I think this is just a reality that th this is a moment of reality. Th this is this happens in any competitive level of sports. Mm -hmm. This is also a moment I played quarterback. A reason why I played quarterback is you ain't never going to see me fight a person that big. Okay? <laughs> you, that, there's, ain't no winning that, No, man. no, no. The, yeah, yeah. I, you uh, want to put your finger in my face. As long as you're not yeah. that big, I'm, I'm going to have an issue with it. But you're as big as Jonathan Allen or Payne, I'm going to let you do it, okay? Fair well, enough. I'm not. We know. That's I'm why just, you play defense. I'm just going. Yeah. I'm That's take why it. I play no. quarterback. We know no one can touch a quarterback. I'm going to take an L, though. I, I never <laughs> forget. I was. I played quarterback as a kid. I started playing football as like nine. Quarterback yeah. and cornerback. I was an athlete. Oh. Um, Were you? No. And I'll never forget. First day of freshman football. Quarterback. And full pads. Full yeah. pads. We're playing open field tackling. You know the drill. And I went to go make a tackle. And I ducked my head. And no. dude made me look like a fool. Yeah. Right. My coach stood over me. And he said, well. That will be the last day you ever play defense. <laughs> so Good for I, you. I couldn't tackle, and that's also why I would never be able to play defense because the big people do it differently. True story. It's a strength when we know our weaknesses. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.